sun, moon, sun, 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 suns sun, and moons, sun, and of course I have to welcome back all my stars. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscription button. I want to say welcome to all that have recently subscribed, and arrivederci to those that have recently departed. I wish you well, and peace and healing on your journey, alright? So for those that can keep up, we're going to go ahead and get straight on into this reading, alright? I've already done my meditation protection, called in appropriate guidance, and coverage needed for us. And that includes people thieving my work, plagiarizing me, all right, and sending me ill intentions. I'm a different kind of reader. We hear that all the time, but I truly am. And I just want to give you a heads up, okay? So to those that are here for healing and here for the reading, all right? <clears throat> I welcome you and go ahead and hit that subscription button if you choose to if not all right it's up to you now we're gonna go ahead and get into the reading this is a general reading spirit called me to the table I want to know why am I here spirit either show me what it is I need to see all right so apparently I'm here because we have someone obviously a Pisces for those that are not dealing with Pisces please hold on okay this applies to Sun Moon rising Jupiter Mars as well as Venus but this is Pisces energy okay so no big thing we are transitioning out of Pisces season which is an indication of a completion of karmic cycles right and what we've seen come out throughout this past year is the build-up and what we have recently seen in you know, in, in in the news, you know, on YouTube, in the vlogs, is a lot of things coming out about marriages, okay? So we have Pisces it's here. This could be a Pisces woman for sure. Show. But you this is someone in the shadow that aspect, that all right? Hole. This person is chained to a dead-end situation. They're losing money. It's clouded. You can't see nothing, all right? Pisces in the shadow aspect, okay? In the lower vibration, all right? <clears throat> this is obviously um, regarding a marriage for some. For others, it's regarding a spiritual belief or some sort of uh, spiritual contract, okay? So someone's operating in their shadow aspect. As, he, as we can see, we have a solar eclipse happening, so things was distorted for a while. You didn't have all the information. You could be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius, or you can have that in your chart. But here we have the Empress in the shadow aspect. <clears throat> so what this is telling me, this is either a very controlling mother. Um, this could be a child's mother. This could be your mother, okay? But this is uh, Taurus Libra energy. This is also, uh, you know, a divine, well, I won't say divine feminine. This is a divine feminine uh, possible, all right? This is someone stuck in their... <clears throat> shadow aspect okay this person could also be experiencing some form of depression they may not be uh, feeling very uh, sexual or connecting very much with their children now this has something to to do with the sagittarius or you could you could have taurus or libra and jupiter but someone definitely was foolish over a situation having to do with money someone is tied into a situation that they you know feel they are obligated to now you could have cancer um in your chart definitely sun cancer you could be a moon or a rising as well but here we see the empress behind this cancer so this could be a divine feminine or a child's mother or just a representation of the matriarch something was definitely found out uh regarding a divine feminine or uh you know someone's mother moving forward a victory someone could also purchase a new car this is going to resonate with everyone uh, individually for different reasons if you would like a personal reading my email is oracle at the ether at gmail.com but I feel like there is a new beginning for some of you you could be recently finding out that you're pregnant or you could have given birth <clears throat> all right some of you may be um, twins but I heard triplets okay uh, either show me what it is I need to see tower moment so something was built on a unsturdy foundation, okay? This is a, a relationship being built on surface, on uh, things that are shallow, okay? By being in a shallow <clears throat> aspect, excuse me, someone needs to speak their truth. 
Now, this is definitely Aries or Scorpio energy. All right. Somebody could also be dealing with the Gemini, but this could be a soul contract, and that could be my guides indicating that. All right. So for those that are dealing with the Virgo, this will resonate. Aries or Scorpio, Pisces, and uh, Taurus, Libra, and I do see Capricorn behind here. But what this is telling me is someone went in to reflect with the hermit being here. Someone could have also been instructed to go within, all right? Someone could definitely be um, in court having to go through some sort of legal matters or litigation, all right? Someone feels like they are definitely at a turning point or they feel one approaching. Someone could definitely be looking back. I'm hearing finances. Someone needed to confront something that was hidden, something um, possibly having to do with the Capricorn, but we have the devil here. But what this is telling me is uh, someone may have overlooked something in the past, okay? This could have been a red flag for someone. It could have been passion, greed, lust, okay? Someone was definitely operating out of their lower self. With Saturn being here, this is a confirmation most definitely for those of you that are Capricorns or dealing with Capricorns. Saturn is all about karma, Um Aquarius as well, okay? Someone may have not put up firm boundaries in the past, needing to take some sort of authority, have some sort of structure, or, um, you know, someone may also feel violated, I'm hearing. You could, okay, so yeah. Someone could be going to jail or facing jail time. I just got to say that, all right? Somebody could also have some sort of FBI or something, something with the FBI, okay? <sighs> All right, so here we have the Aries. Someone could have also prophesized this or had some sort of psychic uh, tell them or warn them about some sort of tower moment coming with the high priestess being here. This is some more Pisces energy. <clears throat> this could be Gemini, Virgo, or um, Cancer, okay? I feel like someone is... Uh, is aggressively seeking counsel, but however, I feel like there's some sort of aggression towards this high priestess, all right? So you could be a reader, or you could be a psychic, or, you know, you could be uh, a clairvoyant. It's, it's so many of them, all right? So a highly sensitive, this, this, is, this is going to resonate with people differently okay with venus somebody definitely received some sort of reading having to a love reading okay possibly about a marriage where they were told about an ending coming uh in the future you could be a scorpio but this is telling me this is a transformation all right somebody also could be practicing some sort of a law of attraction or alchemy here you could also be doing astral traveling okay yeah, tower moment. <clears throat> I feel like someone uh, may have uh, changed up their, their views or they did some sort of uh, research, okay? Someone started asking for protection as they travel in the astral realm here, okay? With the moon and Scorpio, you could have a Scorpio moon, but what this is telling me is someone definitely is in a shadow, their shadow selves, Okay, this person is running from karma, running from facing their dark side. They could also be projecting a lot of insecurities on, on people with the hermit being in the shadow. This is someone refusing to face the light, refusing to take accountability. This is also someone that operates in darkness. I'm hearing operates well in darkness. Somebody definitely does moon magic as well as taboo magic. We're talking about blood and things of that sort. With Sagittarius being here, this is definitely a spiritual leader. This is someone that uh, may receive payment. They could be a Sagittarius, Taurus, uh, Scorpio, Virgo. But this is someone that operates very well in the shadows, okay? Uh, Aquarius, this is giving me shapeshifter. This is shapeshifter energy. Okay, so someone definitely uh, receives some sort of karma with the Wheel of Fortune being here. Okay, you could be this emperor, whether if you're male or female, Aries or uh, Taurus for some of you. Okay, yeah. Somebody may have definitely left the home due to something that was done in the shadows here. Okay, <clears throat> let's see. 
that was a long intro, but it's going to resonate. I had to get it out, all right? So right now, we're looking at a tower moment because something was built. Okay, my apologies. I hope we don't have any more interruptions. You know, um, someone, somebody wants someone to reach out, most definitely, okay? Somebody could also have communication blockages as well, all right? I feel like someone feels unstable here. You may be using uh, your friends or family to get through a moment, okay? I feel like someone is uh, very much seeking solitude or seeking some sort of spiritual counsel as well as legal. Why is open up here? Why is open up here? What is the messages? Show me. Keep an open mind and let go of controlling issues, okay? A lot of situations to unfold naturally. Your soulmate may differ from your uh, usual type and expectations would keep an open mind. Okay, so I feel like someone definitely felt like they got caught off guard. <clears throat> I feel the energy of someone that deals with a lot of shallow individuals. Either show me what it is I need to see. Why is open up here? Make an effort, okay? Great love is worth taking the steps you are guided to take. And, yeah, that codependency, that's what that devil energy is. And that would keep, that is what keeps a lot of these uh, relationships together, right? People like to say, you know, uh, bring in religion. However, all signs point towards source or whatever it is you believe in that things need to end all right and then uh you know it becomes a power struggle with the natural laws right so someone here is in a codependent situation addictions are affecting your romantic love life now this addiction could be people places or things it could be money it could be lifestyle it could be attention all right somebody definitely needs to complete something someone definitely did you could have walked away so we have engagement your love life is ascending is ascending to a higher level of commitment so <clears throat> for some of you this is an ex definitely wanted to come back from the past somebody that you had a uh, a karmic contract with okay some of you you are aware of this for some of you this is what's happening to the person that may have walked out of your life or ghosted you you could have children with this person person as well it says your love life is being affected by children i feel like for the person that is a third party in a situation you may be waiting for this person to reach out you could also be watching this person's social media so, <clears throat> why is the hermit here? Oh, so we have a soulmate, a, a, a balance, a situation that was off balance and a release. So I am getting Aries energy. Now, this could be a partnership that may have started really quickly. For some of you, you could be an Aries or this person is an Aries. They could also have a, a Virgo um I'm hearing rising or moon. Somebody definitely released someone due to a situation being unbalanced. This person could have also be going through going to court or going through litigation. Okay. And somebody's definitely under some sort of investigation. Somebody's going through someone's finances here. Why is reach out? Why is reach out here? Okay, impatient with the moon card here. That's this always looked like the moon, someone reaching for the moon. This gives me obsession energy. Someone knows that some something is destined to be. All right, this this always gives me a high priestess energy, cancer energy, Pisces energy, all right, or some sort of spiritual leader. There's many people that have their hands in the pot in this situation. So someone is definitely impatient. Someone may feel like um, they're in a situation where they're being guided, okay, almost like by uh, some sort of illusion. Someone could be having illusions or hallucinations, but <clears throat> someone could also be being guided in their dreams about moving forward. They know that this is destiny, that they needed to complete something. Someone is working due diligently on a project here. You could be an artist. <clears throat> you could be also rejecting people's calls. Somebody is also rejecting work here yeah somebody i feel the energy of somebody rejecting work you you feel like you come to the end uh, uh and you know you feel like uh you're a suit in this situation almost like a tool 
some of you, you may have uh, went to college for one thing and found yourself, uh, you know, attracted to something else. You had some sort of enlightenment or epiphany. For some of you, it was in a dream here. I'm hearing uh, beyond your wildest dreams. Somebody could have sold you some sort of illusion. Some of you has something to do with a modeling contract here with the faith and, and quest. Yeah, prayer and insecurity. <clears throat> Someone could have felt like they got violated or misused by a modeling contract. Something to do with the porn industry as well. With instinct here. Why is impatient here? Yeah, passion, impartiality. Okay, so yeah, some somebody could definitely be having some sort of scandalous role. I'm 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 hearing dominatrix, but it's like a really I don't know. Okay, uh, somebody could be into like sex clubs or things of that sort. Okay. Okay, yeah. Someone needs to heal something from their past. I feel like somebody may also have a lot of addictions or addictive behavior. This one, this is somebody that has a lot of, they do a lot of things, like, I'm getting deep, dark web type of stuff here, okay? Somebody could also be finding out something online. Why is open up here? Faith. Yeah, somebody is praying for someone to come back or for someone to unblock them, okay? You could feel like this person blocked you in the past, Okay. Yeah, someone is, is, I feel like someone is trying to force somebody to open up or force somebody to have the same belief system as them. Yeah, with the mysticism, somebody is, is, is wearing a, self, a false self mask or presenting some sort of illusion. Someone wonders why someone won't come to them or won't have sex with them here. Someone was praying to get out of a relationship with codependency. This person felt blocked spiritually. Yeah, that's why we had the suit here. Someone definitely feels like a victim or they feel like someone plays a victim for someone to stay in a relationship. Yeah, with the facade here. Yeah, okay, yeah. Perfection, we have Virgo in the lower vibration. Someone presents themselves uh, falsely, okay, they present themselves one way to the world and behind closed their doors, they are something else. They could also be very abusive. Someone comes from an abusive home here. Faith. Why is faith here? Self-worth, okay, so yeah, if somebody walked away and they want you to come back or you want this person to come back, this was something that was very tumultuous in nature. It was a lot of fights. It was a lot of passion as well. There was also a lot of <clears throat> other individuals in your relationship, okay? This was a, a couple that was often... Uh, okay, for some of you, you could be musicians, okay? So you're in the public eye. So this is this may be a for show type of relationship, like a celebrity for show thing here. Someone met, yeah, gossip and enlightenment. Somebody, yeah, somebody maybe. Okay, this is weird. So I'm getting somebody's thinking they're um, they're gonna recover financially through some sort of gossip or scandal. Okay, that's what I'm getting. Self-worth, somebody is trying to um, get some money off a of scandal, off of wisdom. Self-worth, that's the truth. Completion, something that's going to come out, somebody's going to use their instinct. It's like they're going to know right in the nick of time. Everything is, is, is going to fall like in a sequence. I'm getting... Uh, what is that? Final destination. Like final destination is going to be a sequence of things that come out. Yep. Facade. Renewal. Service. This is somebody that's in the public eye. This person is causing a lot of confusion. This is for multiple people in different situations. Perseverance. Retreat. Wise retreat here. It's time to disconnect from the world. Workaholic. So someone definitely works a lot here. Okay, this person works so much they are confused. Somebody could also lost a loved one and they use work uh, to keep themselves occupied. Somebody is also uh, 
<clears throat> having work done on a marriage or trying to uh, use mysticism, voodoo, hoodoo, whatever it is to get a relationship back here with the trick trickery and gratitude and the quest. Yeah, guilty. Somebody feels guilty because they did some sort of work to get a partner or to break up a partnership, workaholic. It's going to be found out, though. Why is workaholic here? Quest, blocking. Yeah, grief. Somebody feels, uh, uh, I was going to say sympathy. Somebody feels sympathy or some sort of remorse. I feel like it's, uh, I heard co-op or covert situation, like a group of people. Yeah, with growth, quest. Okay. Yeah, somebody could have, uh, have gotten blocked here. This is like a scandal that multiple people came up with and somebody's going to blow the whistle here. This is interesting. All right, what is the message for this, for those that I, I see? Leo, courage. Somebody's going to, somebody's definitely going to break silence here, okay? Why? Why, why, why is courage here is what I was going to say. Why do they need courage? Why do these people need courage? Show me. To follow your passion, to follow your dreams. Somebody, oh, somebody could have a love child. Somebody, somebody definitely could be having a, a, a child here with the financial heal, health. Uh, become a clear channel. This is saying to uh, kill all the noise. I'm hearing somebody could also need to disconnect from all social media platforms with financial health. They could also need to cleanse, do some sort of spiritual cleanse. If you're, um, yeah, and reassess this, reassesses the situation, lighten your load. Somebody definitely needs to come clean with something or release something, or it's going to be released for you. Just as somebody could be worried about a home, someone is definitely feeling empowered. Uh, yeah, somebody's pregnant. Okay, look, looking forward. Oh, Jesus. It's financial health. Someone definitely is uh, reassessing something that they did in the past that's going to potentially oh that's going to potentially disrupt their financial health or is possibly doing this this is someone that moves impulsively moves off their passions this is also someone that could have plotted some sort of financial scheme and it's going to backfire but live life to the fullest for some of you uh you you definitely have someone coming in if you made it to the end for some of you, you definitely have somebody coming in that you're going to uh, have some sort of financial wealth or abundance with, and you're being told to, like, say no to all distractions. All right, like, comment, subscribe, share. If you'd like to donate our book, that information will be in the description box below. Do not get scammed. If you want a reading, contact me, oracleoftheether at gmail.com. Like, comment, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you later. We finna have the shenanigans tonight. All right, yeah, we finna have the shenanigans tonight. All right, so let me get that together. Pride in reverse. Interesting. So someone is stuck in their ego. Very prideful, refusing to take accountability. Someone could also be placing blame on others. This is regarding a spiritual partnership, okay? The hermit. This is something very spiritual <laughs> that needs to come to some sort of completion. Someone definitely wants to reach out. I feel like you are being watched or you are watching this person, okay? So, yeah, this is going to resonate for people, again, differently, okay? Self-love. You may have walked away and your person or you are are reflecting on things of the past. OK, you may also be realizing why a relationship didn't work out. OK, some of you are moving forward. There could be someone wanting to reach out and uh, yeah. This person that you put on a, pe a pedestal, someone could also feel like they uh, want to reward someone. Okay, yeah, this person needs to take the lead. I feel like, yeah, okay, for some of you, this is your twin, 
okay, whether if you're male or female. Some of you are high priestess or high priest. So, yeah, someone definitely did some work regarding uh, relationship. Okay. Someone could also be trying to, to repair their finances due to an unstable partnership, something that was karmic in nature. Why is open up here? Show me what it is I need to see. <clears throat> Forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in the present moment. Okay? And separation, time apart from your partner, is on the horizon. All right? So this is definitely a karmic uh, partnership where you had to learn a lot from yourself. Okay, this is confirming uh, a lot about yourself, okay? So this is confirming what what I'm saying. You don't have to be a Virgo, but this is someone going in and doing some 